Merry Christmas, you legends. Here's a cheeky compilation video to get yourself stuck into. The year's best and worst bits throughout the streams. This is the Flying Pig United Extra channel. Make sure you subscribe to this channel, Flying Pig United Extra, for more content throughout 2024. But thank you for being here with me on the channels throughout 2023. Enjoy this compilation. Much love to all you legends. Have a wonderful Christmas and a happy new year. Piggy loves you. And remember, smash that like button, hit the subscribe button, and let's be having you. Broider has got a chance. He's played it back post. No fucking bullshit. They've undone us, mate. Jack pigging fucking green his shit off your hairy dog's bollock. He's fucking done it as well, you fucking hair banded melt. Fuck yourself, Kieran Knightley looking prick. He's actually fucking put it in the back of the knee. Shit. Mate, De Bruyne unlocks our defence with that fucking ball in from the edge of the area. Man, the fucking absolute ginger tosser. And he's completely done us. Arsenal with the ball to the back post. No header on goal. Oh, shit. And there is the equaliser, guys. Eddie and Ketia, man. Fucking hell, bud. He's done it as well. It's a good header at the back stick. Fuck. And there you go, guys. Arsenal. I've got the fucking equaliser, guys. That is absolutely guff, man. That is absolutely guff. Oh, shit. Back enough for Arsenal. Oh, no. Fucking hell. He's hit one from distance, mate. And he's absolutely big near the bottom left-hand corner, mate. Shit. gas casting, mate. Just like Marcus Rashford in the first half, mate. An absolute thunder strike. Fucking hell, man. Oh, it's just such a fucking lazy, lazy goal, man. Now's the time to fucking grow our bollocks. Chance for Arsenal at the end. They've put it back across. Goal. No. Oh, fucking hell. No. It's bottled over the line, mate. No, 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 no. What an awful fucking gas-tastic time to do it as well. Piss poor. Eddie and Ketia Bonner's over the line. It's a fucking shit show. He's definitely offside, mate. Go on. Yes, mate. He's going to be offside. Yes, mate. Oh, fuck, man. They've awarded it, guys. They fucking awarded it, mate. They were having a look at it. I thought there was a potential offside. They've given it. Fucking bullshit, man. And we've been fucking done by the VAR there, guys. What a stitch up. The fucking stink show. And there you go, the Arsene Hollands are in the lead, unjust at the end, if you ask me. Bollocks. Band of Merry Melters there, celebrating like they've already won the fucking league, bunch of losers. No, Liverpool shot on goal. Oh, fucking Nora's gush. It's done. It's Gakpo. Oh, fucking hell, he's found the bottom right hand corner. It's a great finish as well from the Toad. Fuck me. And against the run of play, Liverpool have got the lead. Shit. Fuck, man. Shit, that's so undeserved, though. United were battering them last 20 minutes. Ah, oh, shit. But, you know, like I keep saying, guys, this is Ten Hag's United. Fucking come on, boys. Fucking come on, United. We will come back and beat these melts. No! They fucking done us, Darwin Pooners has made it 2-0 to the Scousers with that fucking greased up Danny Zuko hairdo fucking prick looking motherfucker. Damn it! Damn it! Oh, damn you all the way to Hades, you fucking 100 million pound melt. He's done it as well. Shit, man. Shit, guys. That is so unfortunate, man. Well, it's not unfortunate. It's a shitty bit. It's defended again by Manchester United. Fucking bottle job in it. Salah, he's done us. He's done us. Gagpo, he's done us. Oh, no, boys. Oh, no. It's 3-0 to Liverpool. He's completely rinsed us. What a finish. Fuck, man. No. This is not what we need, mate. We're getting fucking completely embarrassed by the Scousers again, mate. What the fuck, man. After a really, really good... Spell of play over recent weeks. We're getting pumped, dude. What the fuck sort of defending is this, dude? Oh, my God. It's proper abysmal fucking gash-tastic schoolboy-esque shite again from United at the back. Come on, sub on Harry Maguire, for fuck's sake. Might as well. Fall for Salah. Oh, no. It's so fucking lucky and unfortunate, man. At the same time, for the fucking Scouse bastards, Salah's just fallen to him perfectly. What a shit. So he smashed it in the roof of the net. He's fucking smashed it in the roof of the net, guys. This is a shambles, man. A fucking absolute shambles. Have you seen what's what's occurring? Everything we're touching's turn into shite. The team is awful. Previously, Eric Ten Hag has had the Midas touch at United. Everything he turns touches turned to gold. He's got the fucking shitest touch at the moment. He's everything in this game. He's turned into raw shite. This is terrible, man. Oh, no. Oh, no, guys. It's 5-0 to the fucking Scalcieri's, bro. Darwin Pudez. The guy we were taking the piss out of for them. Spunk 100 million on and done us again today. It's a brace for Gash Poo and a brace for Pudez. I don't understand what's happening, man. 5-0 to the fucking Scalcieri's, bud. 
What the fuck, man? This is preposterously, unbelievably gash. How can it go from being such a great team to looking like we got Bill and Ben the flower pot men in the fucking back line of defence, mate? It's time to get Harry Maguire on the pitch. It really is. Guys, I don't know what I'm witnessing here. This is dead. It feels like I'm witnessing a fucking murder. They've almost done us again. No, they have done us again. Salah has just fallen to him, mate. And he takes his shirt off. Um, And he's just made it six goals for Liverpool against United today. What the fuck in that all in the name of crumble jobs is going on here? Fucking lucky lucky boys they are Liverpool. It's landed perfectly for Salah on the edge of the six yard box and he's tobed it in the twat. It's unreal. This is unreal. Six nil it is. Six fucking nil man. What the fuck Salah. Oh no Liverpool can make it seven can they? Oh no guys it is as well man. It's seven nil to the Scousers man. Seven nil. Firmino gets in the back of the net mate. No. Seven goals. Seven. Seven. Not a magnificent seven, a fucking complete monstrosity seven here today. They've done a seven nil, what the fuck, guys? This is the worst game of football I've ever seen, guys, from Man United, isn't it? Seven nil against the Scousers. We'll never lift this one down. This is going to be played back for years and years and years and years. There's the final whistle. Thank God that's over, guys. What an absolute abomination to mankind. We have just lost 7-0 to the Scousers. I don't even, I can't even believe I'm saying that. It is officially the worst loss I can ever remember, guys. I think it's the worst loss I can ever remember in my fucking life, guys. How does it get any worse than that? How can you be so gash after being so good? 7-0 for fuck's sake. Man, oh man. Somebody's going to upload this to the hub. This is going on fucking porn up, guys, this fucking game. This is a bang, bang, bang. I don't understand how it's happened. Today, Man United are Angela White. We have been fucking done. I don't know what to say, guys. Oh, fucking hell, and there it is, mate. This is why we need quality players to come in. This is why we need quality players to come in, because we're 2-0 down now against fucking magpies. I don't believe it. We fucking bottled it, bud. It's absolutely abysmal. Rashford is Trashford today, mate. Back to being Gashford again. Oh, fuck this guy. It's a fucking joke. What the fuck are you doing, boys? How long's left in this game? Two to around five minutes go fuck this! Mate, I feel pity, I feel pity. You're playing absolutely shitty and shitty and shite. That's what they're doing, mate. What the fuck is the matter with these fucking sugar plum fairies today? Pathetic each to a man. Oh, fucking hell, guys. There's the final whistle. Thank God that's over, man. Super I mean, what a, what, a, what a bunch of melters, though, guys. Talk about fannies or us. They literally didn't give a toss our players today. Oh no, Maguire's fucked it, mate. I don't believe it. No, you fucking absolute bloody Easter Island brat. He's only gone and done it again. I don't believe him. He's actually the most useless footballer in the history of the world. Hey, Maguire, you fucking complete lunchbox. Oh my god, he's like a fucking rotten plastic square lunchbox, mate, with a fucking 16 week old sandwich in the middle, molding away. He's a fucking useless lunchbox of a moldy bastard. It's fucking shocking. Are you fucking kidding me, man? I don't believe it. I can't fucking believe it, guys. The fucking lunchbox has melted, mate. Honestly, it's a fucking crumble job from Maguire. You're a fucking useless wanker, Harry Maguire. He's a disease melter. I've had enough, mate. I've had enough of that guy. I mean, can you be any worse at football than that? Shit. Kane shot. Oh, no. It's 2-1, guys. Fucking hell. It's Porro. Porro's put it in the back of the net with a lovely volley outside the box. Fuck. And that gives Spurs a lifeline, guys. And they're back in the game. 2-1. Fucking come on now, United, mate. Don't bottle this now. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, fucking bullshit. It's a fucking bottle job, mate. Sun Young Min tapping in the back post. Fucking hell. Fucking hell, guys. We're fucking useless, mate. We're fucking useless. We were tuning up, chilling and killing like Matt Dillon on penicillin a minute ago. Now we fucking might as well be out of our mind on methamphetamine, for fuck's sake, these players. They're drugged. They're in the K-hole. They're on fucking ketamine in this half. Wake the fuck up, guys. Honestly, wake the fuck up, guys. Pathetic. Fucking gastastic football from United here, guys. They were so shit in the first half as well. Literally, what the fuck are we doing with these drug-taking mules? What's the matter with them? What the fuck are they doing, guys? Honestly. What the fuck are they doing? They look like sweet mugs. What are they doing? They're playing like junkie. There's the final whistle. Oh, well, fucking useless twats, honestly. Seriously, guys, what a complete bunch of useless, spineless mug bottle job meltbags. 
Then why the fuck are we allowing these opposition spud melters to come at us? They're absolutely shite. They lost 6-1 the other day to Newcastle. They're a fucking joke. Oh, Luke Shaw's handballed it in the box. No, look at it. No. No, they're going to fucking look at it here. They're going to give a penalty for the handball from Luke Shaw. Oh, no fucking way. Don't. Please, no. Oh, fuck off. Fucking hell, mate. And this is what happens when you fucking bottle job it all game. And don't put up a fight whatsoever. You get bent over by the seagulls, man. The ref's gone over to look at the monitor. It's VAR, for fuck's sake. He's given the fucking penalty, guys. Fucking hell, mate. The last kick of the fucking game after the stoppage time's finished. Fucking bullshit. I don't believe this. He's gonna step up. Here we go. McAllister for Brighton. Come on, De Gea. Oh, fucking hell, mate. And De Gea throws the wrong way. We've lost the fucking game to Brighton. What a fucking absolute... Is it even still working? I don't know. I think it's fucking broken. Just like Manchester United's fucking dreams of getting any result on the road in this fucking game, mate. It's a fucking shit show. We've completely bottled it, guys. What the fuck? Man United have completely fucking shat the bed, man. I don't believe it, dudes. Oh, after all that. I told you I'd take a fucking draw at the end of it. We've thrown it away. There's the full-time whistle. What a fucking bunch of clunge weasels, mate. It's game over, Brian. I've done us. You know what? We fucking whimpered out there, guys. Why do we always get shat on by the seagulls, mate? Why do the seagulls always have to have a fucking chicken vindaloo the night before and shit all over us? What's the matter with this fucking team? We can't get anything against these Brighton knobs. It's fucking shambolic. And Luke, saw your fucking little pretty bentos got in melt. What's he thinking? We're a bunch of fucking bottlers, guys. It's time for these fucking pansies to fuck off, though, mate. People like Tony Marcio, Jaden Sancho, you fucking shite, mate. No, David De Gea, you've made a fucking absolute calamity situation, bro. I don't fucking believe it, no. What? And he's done it again, mate. This is what he's defending with, a fucking claw for a hand. What the fuck has he done, mate? I don't believe it. He's fucked it, mate. Are you bloody Rob Green in disguise, man? What the fuck? Not again, David, not again. Ben Arama gets a shit trickling guff shot off a go and David De Gea has a flubby, flubbly arm fucking his neck. His name's Robin Williams or something. His arm's made of flubber, this twat. What has he done, dude? Mr. Jellyhand. Look at this shit. It's like he started the game instead of wearing a goalkeeper glove. He's wearing those number one fucking big foam hands or something, mate. And it's gone straight through his fucking hand. What the fuck, mate? And there's the final whistle, guys. We've absolutely fucking fucked it. The losers have struck again. The crumble jobs have struck again, mate. Somebody's popped our fucking space opera today, mate. We're playing with fucking deflated bollocks. You've crumbled it, guys. It's a fucking horror show out there, mate. Honestly, if never mind fucking Scream, never mind fucking Nightmare on Elm Street, this is the true horror show at the London Stadium we've just seen today, guys, for fuck's sake, mate. We've got fucking Jason Voorhees playing up front, aka Voot fucking Schmeghurst, Tony Martial. It's a fucking horror show, guys, out there, mate. What the fuck are we doing? Enough of seeing these pratties. Pratties, the lot of them. Pratties. Chance for Spurs. Oh, fucking hell. It's pinball back across goal. Lucky bastards. The ball's taking a fucking deflection from the right side coming in there. And it's been tucked away there, guys, by Saar. It's an absolute fucking shitter. Undeserved against the run of play. They have started the second half well here, but fuck me. Fucking gashtastic. Fucking duck a doodle dick bags. We are 1 0 down. Shit. Oh no, it's a fucking absolute bloody gastastic finish by Ben Davis, mate. He's skewed when he's not even connected with it properly. It's a fucking complete melter. Andre Onana, what are you doing, Andre? After a great fucking game, he's stuck to the ground, mate. He must have started some fucking chewing gum or something. He's completely rooted. It's a gastastic trickle of an effort from Ben Davis, and it's totally flummoxed Andre Onana. For fuck's sake, guys. The shittest piece of defense ever, guys. What the fuck, man? It's a fucking OG from Lissandro Martinez, guys. Fucking bullshit. Six stains. Absolute fucking complete codswallop. Oh, 2 nil to Spurs. It's a fucking shit fest. There's the final whistle, guys. We've been absolutely drugged up by Tottenham Hotshite. Ten Hag looks like he's about to fucking cry and do a natural impression here. He can't believe it. What a shocking second half by Manchester United. His players have completely bollocked it up. No doubt about it. That second half was absolutely shambolic, guys. What an abysmal mess of melters. They literally performed like a fucking gashtastic bloody manure truck going out there, stinking it up. We have literally 
pull back the fucking duvet and taken a shit right on on our season. Awful, 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 awful gash display from United here. We are now 10th in the league. Fuck me with a goal difference of minus one after, after two fucking games. We are mid-table mediocrity shite. Oh no, it's already an equaliser for Arsenal. Oh, the guards put it in the back of the fucking net. Shit the bed, guys. No fucking way. Looked up for two seconds. We've been in the lead for literally fucking 29 seconds, mate. Goodness me. Holy shit, I struggle to fucking get a birthday fucking nut off in that time. Do you know what I'm saying? This is ridiculous. How the fuck... That we already equal, they already equalised against us. I don't believe it. Odegaard's got it level for Arsenal. Literally thirty seconds in. What the fuck, guys? Goodness me! Wake the fuck up, United! Look at this shite. We've just been completely undone. Too busy celebrating the last goal. Too busy, busy fucking. Look at this shit. Oh. Go on, Nacho! He's put it away, guys! Come on, I called it, guys! Alejandro Garnacho! has got the winner! Come on! 2-1 to the United! Yes, guys! Counter, Fred through the middle! Alejandro Garnacho! He's spotted it past Ramsdale! Fucking get in! Come on! He's done ya! The real star boy, Alejandro Garnacho! They're checking the VAR for offside! Don't you dare! Don't you fucking dare! No fucking way! They've chalked it off, guys! They've chalked it off! I don't believe it! He was on side all day long! That's bang out of order! Come on, he was on! You can't get any more fucking on side than that! We've been stitched up, guys! We've been fucking stitched up here by the Arsenal holders fucking paying the referee mugs off! We've been stitched! Fuck this, guys! This is wrong! This is an injustice! This is a complete fucking shit show! You're kidding me! Mikel Arteta's been fucking fondling someone behind the scenes here! That's a fucking joke! Come on! Absolute shambles! No fucking way they scored at the near post! I don't believe it! Declan Rice, you fucking injustice prick! No way! Declan fucking condiment himself has fucking scored at the near post! I don't believe this fucking shit! It's an absolute fix! It's a fix! It's a fucking disgrace, mate! We had a perfectly legitimate goal from Garnacho ruled out! And Declan Rice has just pinged one into the near post! And it's fucking gone past the drone line! It's a shit show, mate! And that fucking pasta carbohydrate looking prick has fucking scored! Fuck off Declan Rice! Don't believe it mate! No fucking way! No way! Oh no no! Arsenal are going to make it 3-1 at the end guys! Jesus is through 1-1! One -on -one. He's done us! It's 3-1 to Arsenal! No! He's done us as well! Fucking unbelievable shit! That shit! I'm fucking out of here mate! I'm fucking out of here! What a fucking load of fucking bullshit! I don't believe it! Fuck off! Bullshit fucking game of bastard wank piss bollocks and fucking hairy beanbags in your fucking eyeball with a fucking French stick. Fuck this bullshit man. What the actual fuck? My God. Shit. Oh, fucking hell. It's Danny Welbeck, mate. Oh, my goodness me. He's popped it in, mate. The ball comes in from the right and he's slotting it into the bottom left-hand corner. Fucking hell. Piss it, guys. Back from the fucking brink. Of being gassed, and he's come and he's pissed all over us at Old Trafford again. Danny Welbeck, mate, Agent Welbs for Brighton, former Manchester United player, the guy we sacked off because he was gashed. It's piss poor for defending by Victor Lindelof as well. Goodness me, playing like a piece of holy fucking Swedish cheese this way. Just simple tapping for Welbs, guys, with his left boot. It's too fucking easy. This. Bradford. Yes! Rasmus Hoyland dunks it in, but I'm right. Come on, and I can fucking get in there. Oh, yes! Get in, come on, yes, mate. This is what it's all about. Fuck yes. Get in there, Hoyland. We are checking the, if the ball's out of play. No! The ball's out of play, guys. Fucking hell. Fucking hell. The ball's out of play as well. Shit. They're looking at the VR and it's a fucking Nats ball bag out of play. Fuck it. Literally a Nats fucking bollock bag out of play. Unbelievable. They're oh, fuck VAR, guys. They fucking removed the goal for us. This is unreal shit. Fucking unbelievable shit. Wank bags alert. Bullshit VAR again. Super, fuck the fuck. What a shit show. No! Oh, no! They've done us, guys! It's 2-0! 
It's 2-0 to Brighton. They fucking bumped us raw, guys. It's an absolute penetration. We've just fallen asleep in the back there, guys. And the Seagulls have taken a big fucking shite on us from the top of the fucking skyscraper, guys. They've eaten a vindaloo the night before after washing down it with a whole bunch of fucking chips, hot chips, stolen from the fucking seaside crew. And they fucking pooed on us. From a great fucking height, it's Pascal Gross. And it's an absolutely gross piece of defending by Manchester United, to be fair. It's disgusting. They've just unleashed the fucking explosive diarrhea from the Seagulls' arsehole on us, for fuck's sake, guys. There you go. It's over. It's fucking over. It's 2-0. Everybody's crumbled. Casemiro, get him off the pitch, man. I never thought I'd say that, but can we get Casemiro off, please? He's fucking janked today. Well, it's fucking shite. Season over, game over. The season's done. The season's finished. The season's fucked. We're five games into the season. The season's over. Holy shit, Brighton in our box. Shot on goal for Brighton. Oh, no way. It's 3-0, guys. Sean Pedro with a stunning finish and Andre Onana pumps it into the back of his own net, mate. Fucking hell. Andre no Nana more like because he's got no fucking abilities to stop the fucking opposition scoring this twat. What the fuck is happening, guys? I don't fucking believe this shit, guys. We've fucked it raw now. Look at this, Andre Onana. What the fuck? It's a first-time pop shot. There's Manchester United fans leaving the stadium already. They've seen enough. I've seen enough. This is fucking awful. Guys, gouge out my fucking eyeballs and fry them in fucking cinnamon. This is terrible. What a fucking awful fucking display by United. Dude, Andre Onana's been absolutely fucking duff-tastic today. David De Gea wouldn't be this shit. You know what I mean? It's all going wrong. The players, the players have fucked it. The managers fucked it. It's a shambles, and the players, fucking tiny shrivel ball bag melts. There's the final whistle, guys. Manchester United have lost three-one to the shitty Seagulls yet again, mate. What the fuck's the matter with us? Talk about bogey team. Fucking snotted all over us. Diarrhea all over us. Shat all over us. These fucking Brighton melt can't stop dicking Manchester United, can they? We are their fucking rent boy, basically. What in the fuck is the matter with us when it comes to playing Brighton? We are shy. In fact, when it comes to playing anybody right now, we're fucking useless. Into the area. Andre Onana with an absolute fucking howler! No! No! We need to get David De Gea back! This is a fucking shambles! He can't stop a fucking simple easy shot! I don't believe it, no! It's a complete goalkeeper howler from Onana! No fucking way! Oh my goodness me! I don't fucking believe this shit! Oh, we were doing so well and it's the fucking easiest piss ball trick and gas tastic weakest piss ball shot ever! It's the easiest save ever! What are you doing, Andre Onana? What are you doing? This guy's making Fabian Bartes look like a fucking absolute worldie for United! Who have we got? Is this Massimo Taibi in disguise for fuck's sake? I don't believe this! Come by and again at us! They've teed it up! Shot on goal! No! It's in there! It's tucked in the bottom right hand corner! Oh no! I stood there mate like a fucking scarecrow from Wizard of Oz before he's been brought to life mate! Oh he's just in the field fucking outstretched and still! What's going on? They've just started it in the bottom right hand corner! It's 2-0 to Bayern already! They're fucking drubbing us up! Ten Hag shaking their head mate! He's ready to fucking get the old wooden clog out and kick people up the ass. What the Fuck. We are Ghost FC, mate. What the fuck, bro? Our backline's a bunch of fucking ghosts, mate. Honestly, it's a complete shambles. The Marshmallow Man is fucking goal, guys. What's going on? It's a fucking whole bunch of ghosts, man. Slabby Kane, aka Rodney Trotter. And he slots it bottom left hand corner for fuck's sake. Are you taking a piss out of us, ref? Harry Kane just pops it bottom left hand corner. It's nonchalant. It's easy. It's just it's just fucking pre preordained, predetermined, predetermined shit right now. What is this? Are we watching the fucking WWE right now? What is this predetermined shit, bro? Oh shit, chance for Bayern. It's bashed into the top of the roof of the net, mate. No fucking way. And there is the final killer blow to ruin Manchester United's tiny little gas-tastic mincy bloody hopes.
It's done. Penetration. We've been rinsed. Easy, 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 easy for Bayern München. Close down the fucking angle, Andre. Oh, he's shite. He's shite. No, he's shite. He's shite. It's like every single one of our players has taken a fucking pegging out there tonight. They bent over and said, here you go, Bayern. Slip one in, son. It's a fucking... Joke! Holy fucking shit, mate! They've scored, guys! It's 1-0 to Crystal Palace! It's an absolutely filthy finish on the volley, mate! You what? What the fuck, mate? Anderson! Bloody Anderson, guys! Mr. Anderson! And he's put that into the top ends like he's fucking Neo from the Matrix, this twat! How does he manage that? It's an absolutely insane volley! Easy's played it in from the right! Look at this, and it's just... Not dealt with, it's headed away and he's fucking pinged it on the half volley right into the top bins, mate. It's Anderson, guys. What the fuck? And that's the final whistle, for fuck's sake, mate. No fucking way. We've probably lost it to Palace. Palace fucking gash tastic arama game of football there from United. You are shit. You're shit, lads. You're fucking crap, honestly. How are you able to put in such gash tastic performances? How the fuck? Million, billion, billion, zillion fucking pounds worth of talent on the pitch, mate. Might as well be a bunch of fucking jeb ends playing for fucking the dog and duck, my son. On two pounds fifty a fucking game. On fucking three pints if you win. It's a fucking shitter. You, you bunch of losers, man. Serious bunch of losers. The players are fucking shite. Ten aren't fucking shite. It's unbelievable. Instead of getting Stone Cold Eric Steve Austin tenor, we've ended up with fucking Gilberg. It's a fucking shit show, my son. How the hell are we not able to beat Palace at home at Old Trafford? It's fucking unfathomable shit. We're rancid. You're a rancid, festering fucking fart in a container. It's fucking shite. Unbelievable. Fucking unbelievable, my son. Do not bottle this now. Oh no, we fucking bottled it, mate! Wilfred Zaha comes back and bangs one in, mate, just like we did with fucking David Moyes' daughter, my son! It's a fucking absolute nightmare! Just as I was saying, don't fucking bottle it! We bloody well got and bottled it, guys! Fucking hell! Wilfred Zaha with a fucking bouncer, bouncer, bouncer over the fucking keeper, mate. It's fucking shite. He's not even hit it clean. He's fucking lucky, mate. He's just got a little touch on it. It's bounced awkwardly over Onana. We fucking bottled it, lads. And there's a chance for Geller and they've made it 2-2. Two, two. No! They've made it 2-2, two, two, guys. Acton Koglu and that's been fucking coming all game long. Bollocks, mate. Fucking speaking too soon yet again. Fucking bullshit. What the hell, mate? It's fucking shambolic, mate. It's fucking shambolic, mate. What the fuck, bro? It's absolutely fucking joke worthy, mate. Just as we, we can't hold on to a fucking lead, bro. We can't hold on to a lead. It's fucking joke stuff from us, mate. Clown show shit. Clown show shit from United at the back. Every single time we do fucking any chat. We seem to find a way to bottle it. No, I'm not giving away and we've committed a penalty. It's a foul, mate. It's a fucking implosion. No fucking way. Andre O'Nana, you fucking stink, mate. You fucking reek, bro. You're like the fucking Thames River in the Middle Ages. You're full of fucking shit. You're fucking shite. For one on one. Oh, and he's lifting it over Andre Onana like he wasn't even there. Why did Andre Onana fall down to the ground, mate? We've got a six foot five goal. He looks four foot three, this twat. Goodness me. How have we got someone so shit in goal? Literally, we might as well get Buddy Warwick Davis in goal. You know what I mean? We've got Willow playing in as our fucking goalkeeper, mate. We've got fucking Willow in goal. Why the fuck has he gone to ground there, mate? What are we watching? Why are United so unbelievably shit? We just managed to find a way to absolutely crumble at every single fucking game we play. And there's the Super final whistle. Super 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 man. We've been done by a bunch of fucking Turkish barbers, mate. It's a fucking shambles here, guys. What the fucking hell, mate? What are we doing, mate? It's a fucking absolute shambles. We have been completely fucked over, bro. Shambolic defending, mate. 
Fucking gash tastic defended! Oh, horrendous of goalkeeping! And a bunch of fucking complete loser fucking mentality players in this team yet again showing why they indeed are the biggest fucking set of melters that Manchester United have potentially had in my whole fucking lifetime! These Manchester United players are a fucking joke! We made a mistake, shot on goal! No, oh, no, no, we're fucking losing! No, we're fucking losing! And it's Andre O'Nana again! He's fucking shit! I'm telling you, mate! I'm telling you! He's absolutely piss poor! It's a shit bit of goalkeeper that came by Andre Onana! No fucking way! I don't believe this fucking raw shit, bro! How is this man not able to keep a simple picking shot out of his net? It's right fucking at him, mate! He's flopped on the ground, mate! What's he doing? He looks like a fucking fish out of water, this prick! Look at him! And he's got the stop shot stopping prowess of a bloody cod who's in the death throes of life right here! Look at him, mate! Bloody look at him! We've got fucking magic up in goal for fuck's sake, mate! We've let Garados go, and we've got fucking magic up in goal! He's flopping around, bro, splashing away! He can't get a fucking fin on it! He hasn't got any arms, apparently, anymore! He's a fucking fish of a man! Such a soft, weak, gastastic penalty there. It's absolute bullshit. No way that's a pen. Rodri's a diving bastard, isn't he, mate? Okay, Haaland up against Onana. We saw Onana save one the other day. Haaland takes his penalty and he slots it bottom right hand corner. You fucking complete Vigo the Carpathian looking prick, mate. Fuck off. Back to Ghostbusters 2. You complete fucking Greta Thunberg looking hybrid fucking Vigo Mel. Piss off. Jammy bastards. They're so fucking lucky, mate. And Vigo the Carpathian, this fucking mug, puts it in. In the bottom right hand corner, it is a good penalty. He summoned all the fucking pink goo under the city streets there to fucking help him in this evil bidding of Halloween, the fucking prick. Do you know what I mean? Too easy for City, this is too easy for City. Oh, and the back post, oh, for fuck's sake, mate. They've completely pulled our fucking pants down and inserted one in there, for fuck's sake, guys. Erling Haaland with the header of the back post. He's a free man at the back there, not marked up whatsoever. Too easy for City, that. Where's the fucking hunger and desire for these United players to get that fucking ball from these City wing bags? There isn't any. Look at how easy this is for City. They just pass it through us like we're not even there. It's another great save by Andre Onana. Haaland comes in and it's me. Oh, fuck it out, mate. And there it is. It's 3-0. The ball played to the back post where Phil Foden's waiting for it. And he just fucking taps it in, mate. And we've been pumped raw here by Manchester City. It's an embarrassment. 3-0 now. 3 fucking nil now. Could have been 5 6 7 nil without Andre Onana's performance as well. Fuck it out. An embarrassment again, and a fucking embarrassment again, mate! A complete fucking embarrassment, mate! It's a fucking embarrassment again, mate! What the fuck? 3-0 against these city wankbags! Oh shit! Oh shit! Fucking terrible police are played by Manchester United defensively, Gasharama! It's Almiron! Makes it 1-0 for Newcastle! How easy was that for Newcastle? They've cut us open on the break! Counter-attack the shit out of us there. Simple stuff. United all at sea defensively as we always are. And Eric Ten Hag stands on, gives it a head wobble, and looks like he's about to fucking go and have a session of fucking diarrhea at halftime, mate. He looks like he's about to fucking crap his pants. What a fucking shit show. Shot on goal and sneak in and in bottom right hand corner. No fucking way. Come on, you press poor melters. You fucking shit guys. We're 2-0 down. I don't believe it, mate. It's fucking Hall. Hall makes it 2-0 with a pump shot, mate. It's going to the fucking bottom right hand corner. Fucking unbelievable, mate. Fucking unbelievable, mate. It's fucking unbelievable, mate. You know, every single time, every single game, we're getting fucking embarrassed, mate, out here. Fucking embarrassed, mate! Fucking embarrassed in here! Every single fucking week, man! Every single shitty fucking game, mate, we're getting embarrassed here! For fuck's sake! Maguire is so shitty, isn't he? Goodness me, I've been telling you for years, mate! Maguire's a fucking complete breeze block of a slab of a melter, mate! Oh my god! Willits just made it 3 0 to Newcastle! He's lashed one into the bottom right hand corner, mate! And we are witnessing an absolute de de demolition, man! Of a fucking team here, man! This is awful! Manchester United are literally being demolished by Newcastle United right here! It's 3 0 to the Geordie shithouses here! 
against Manchester United, the worst Manchester United side I've seen in my life pretty much here. How are we getting done by Geordie B team? You know what I mean? I'll tell you what, we'd even struggle with if we were playing the cast of fucking Geordie Shaw right now. For fuck's sake, guys. We're fucking shit. Honestly, we're crap, guys. And to deck might as well strip off for the rest of the fucking game, mate. They'd probably bang a fucking brace or something, mate. Anybody can fucking score against us. Let's get, they might as well get fucking Cheryl Cole on against us, for fuck's sake, mate. This team's fucking shit. For fuck's sake, guys. Ah, you fucking losers, man! Oh, Bruno Fernandez misses a fucking sitter! What the fuck? Shit. I've just broken a cup, guys. I don't know what I was doing there. I've broken a fucking cup, guys. Oh, shit. I've broken, I've broken Mrs. P's butterfly mug, guys. Fuck it, how's she gonna go spare? And now Copenhagen coming at us. Raw and they've scored, guys. Fuck the duck a doodle do. Quack, quack, quack. We've been fucked. Fuck a duck, guys. Before half time, Copenhagen are back in the game. Do you know what I'm saying? That's what happened, guys. A lapse in concentration there. Now we're down to 10 men. Now the fucking pressure is on. Now the pressure is on, guys. We could have been cruising to a nice, easy victory. Now we've got to come out second half. With 10 men, and we've stand 45 minutes of pressure from Copenhagen. For fuck's sake, this is not what we needed. It's a shit show. Maguire's committed a handball, mate. It's a penalty. Slappy Maguire, no. Oh, my God, mate. He's fucking done it as well, hasn't he? Of course. Of course, it's Slappy Maguire. He's given away a fucking handball in the penalty time. And it's going to be a fucking penalty to Copenhagen here, guys. For fuck's sake. Slappy slapped it and given away a pen. And the complete melters that we've got on the football club, i.e. Rashford, i.e. Mags and everybody, are fucking doing it. It's a double handball. It's Rafael Varane and fucking Maguire. They're both fucking handballed it, mate. It's double penetration from our centre back, mate. Copenhagen, come on, Andre Nana. Come on, Andre Onana. Referee's going to blow his whistle. Come on, Andre Onana. Goncalves up against him. He takes his run up. Andre Onana! Oh, for fuck's sake, mate! No! It's in the back of the fucking net. Bollocks and 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 fucking bollocks, mate. We were tuning up cruising a minute ago. Fucking tuning up cruising. And now it's 2-2. I don't fucking believe it, guys. What the actual fucking fuck is going on here, mate? You know? 2-0. 2 fucking nil up a minute ago. Oh, for fuck's sake, we've conceded at the back stick, guys, with only a few minutes left. Bollocking, bollocking, hairy fucking love spots in your eyeball all fucking night long. Fuck! And our fucking lead has been shat again. So frustrating. How many times are we going to leave here? With our pants pulled down in this Champions League competition this season so far. Now we've made it very hard for ourselves. I doubt we're going to get back in front in this game here. We fucked it. We've literally woken up on a park bench with a bloody tramp taking our trousers down. That's what's happened here, guys. We were fucking cruising, chilling, having a great night. We woke up seven hours later with our fucking trousers down our ankles with a bloody... Tramp sat next to us with a tub full of fucking petroleum jelly. Another shot on goal. No! 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 It's in the fucking back of the net. Copenhagen. It's funny then. It's fall through to Copenhagen. Oh, for fuck's sake. It's a massive fucking bullshit gas nothing. Motherfucking implosion, mate. It's a fucking absolute gas nothing situation. It's fucking mad shit. It's fucking mental! It's 4-3 dominated! We've been fucking bombed! Oh my god! No fucking way! No fucking way! No fucking way! No fucking way! 4-3 no guffed in there at the fucking back post! No fucking way! Oh my god! Oh my god, no way! We've been fucking robbed! We were tuning up, cruising and chilling! 
Like that's for the incident of the red card! It's fucking bottled us, me! There is the final whistle, guys! There's the final whistle, and Manchester United have been done by a bunch of fucking Dean Pank Bacon lovers! That's right, they're pissed out of their heads on fucking Carlsberg Export for fuck's sake, and we still weren't able to beat them, mate! They're a fucking bang average side, FC Copenhagen! A bang average side! Manchester United! Can't see out a game of football at all, can we? We're cruising even when we actually do fucking finally turn up. We still find a way to fucking bottle it, my son. We've completely crumbled. We are bottom of the Champions League group. What a fucking absolute set of bloody bottle merchants, guys. Ten Hag's bottle job strike again. They find a way to clutch defeat from the jaws of victory. What a set of elders. We've completely fucking shat the game. We've shattered the game! Mugged off, destroyed, ruined, rinsed, fucking bottled on, gashed on, completely messed up, stonked it, gashed it, melted! F fucking bottle jobs, basically, the lot of them, guys. Okay, free kick for Gala. Oh no! For fuck's sake, guys, and it has found its way into the back of the bloody net, mate. It's a shitty, gastastic wank bag of a free kick, to be honest. And it's guff-tastic, absolutely unacceptably poor sort of reactions from Al Andreo Nana. Just stands there on the goal line, does jack shit, to be honest with you. But it's just sort of gone through the wall. Is it the wall? The wall's fucking bottled it. Maybe Andreo Nana doesn't see it because maybe it's gone under the wall or something. I'm needing to have another replay of this shite. Fucking Ziek. Do you know what? That's absolutely gastastic, pansy yes, right? Rubbish defending from our wall. Goodness me, what sort of wall is that? That's not a wall, is it? Fucking hell. It's more like a fucking garden gate, a little picket fence. A little gas plastic picket fence you can just fucking hop over. You know, we, we should be up there competing for all the titles. All the... Oh, sh... Oh, no! We've absolutely fucking bottled it! Andre Nardo shat it again from another ZX free kick! I don't fucking believe it, mate! Dude! Patrick Swayze in goal strikes again, lad! Unbelievable! Ghost-worthy goalkeeping from Andre Nardo! Look at this! The ball comes in from Ziyech, it's too fucking easy! I don't know how he's not stopping that! How the fuck has he not stopped that there, guys? It's ridiculous! Such bad goalkeeping again. He's been incredible lately. He's looked really good. But look at this. Oh my god, that's bad, guys. That's fucking terrible, guys. Oh my goodness me. That is some atrocious goalkeeping right there. It's so pathetic. And it's absolutely fantastic, abysmal stuff from Andre Onana. That's twice in this game. That was absolutely embarrassing goalkeeping right there. Goodness me. To be super fair, it looks like, you know, jack. Andre Onana right there kind of looks like. He's been hanging out with Jay from the Inbetweeners and he's been fucking hanging out in the old dead hand gang. You know what I mean? Where they fucking sit on their hand for fucking 25 minutes before rubbing one out, mate. It looked like he's done that. Is that what he's been doing? He oh, no! And the goggly spanked an absolute fucking banger into the back of the head, mate. Son, past Andre fucking owned on. I do fucking easy, mate. 3-3! Three, three. There it is right there! They've got the fucking equal under guys. It's fucking easy. And we've literally been fucking bummed here. Raw guys, no. Oh, my God. Somebody call up the fucking offenders register and add Galatasaray's name to it. We've been fucking abused here in Turkey. What the fuck are we doing, man? It's a six shot by Agdogoglu. Andre Onana gets beaten. He gets beaten. He's beaten it. His new stick It's too fucking easy, guys. I don't believe this shit. No. Not again. Not again. Another fucking big time high profile bottle job taking place. Not again. Come on, guys. What the fuck's this? Is that the final whistle? Oh, for fuck's sake, guys. We've bloody drawn. We've thrown away two. Two goal leads in this game. I don't fucking really believe it, guys. Two. Two goal leads we've chucked away in this game. Where we could have easily progressed out of the group. Made it definitely in our hands to do so. Now we've got to hope for a result against Bayern Munich. And, and other results go our way. we fucking shat it. It's a big bottle job. Ten Hag, why are you going up and fucking hugging Zia? and smiling with him. You should be fucking going to slap your players around the fucking ear or not going to fucking hug you see the fucking brace goal scorer against us. Oh, Ajax friends. Oh, football friend. Fuck off. Fucking get your players sorted out here, my son. Get them together, kick them up the arse and tell them. Melted lads. We're like a big amorphous pink fucking blob melting all over the fucking turkey here. Ten Hag walks down the, the tunnel. He looks like a beaten man. He looks like fucking... 
He looks like fucking Walter White at fucking end of season fucking eight or whatever at Breaking Bad, mate. He's ready to fucking throw it all away, my son. Hiding under the house, fucking crying his eyes out, my son. In shit loads of problems, shit loads of problems and stuff going on. Can this... Oh, for fuck's sake, we've been fucking undone, mate. No, mate. Fucking bullshit, bro. Just like that. That's what happens when fucking United take all day long to fucking get going and we just bend over and fucking completely passively pants down ourselves. All fucking day long. And once again, it's the fucking gas-tastic team of motors at the back completely bottle dropping it and Newcastle take the lead, which was fucking coming, wasn't it? It was bloody coming all bloody game long, mate. It's fucking gas. We are gas-tastic, mate. Oh, my God. And Ten Hag looks on with his fucking gangster hat, mate. Well, you ain't a fucking gangster, though, are you, Ten Hag, lad? He's rocking his fucking peak. What, trying to be cool, mate? Trying to be fucking peaky blinders? He's looking like a fucking peaky blunder out there. And he's making me feel peaky and sick, this guy. Because we're playing like shit, you fucking peaky blunderer. He's doing my nothing. There is the final whistle. Guy, for fuck's sake, mate. They're useless words, aren't they? Every single one of them thrown. They need a fucking reality check, these twats. They need fucking spanking, mate. Somebody needs to fucking teach these guys a lesson of how to fucking play football, mate. Nobody fucking does know how to play football around here at United anymore. What an awful display. Newcastle United absolutely fucking peppered us raw. Oh, for fuck's sake, Bournemouth has fucking undone us. Oh, my goodness me, no. Four minutes 30, they fucking pumped us raw, my son, and we are losing the bloody game against the Cherries now. What? We're supposed to be making fucking cherry pie of them in this game, but they making popped cherries out of these fucking cherry melts. So far, they've broken our bloody tooth off with the bloody, bloody cherry fucking pip, mate. It's an awful start for United here in the end because Solanke has just bucked it in the back of the fucking net and given Bournemouth the lead. Look at this shot. It's a mistake at the back from the past hour. It's shocking stuff. McTominay can't control it. McTominay with the fucking club foot on the go there. Oh my goodness me. Look at him there. Look at him. Oh my goodness me. And Maggie can't fucking follow it in. Oh, they're back to their best, aren't they? Slabby and Mags. Slabby and McTominay back to their fucking best, mate. It's like that movie Carry On Screaming if you've ever seen it. With Odd Bod and Odd Bod Bloody Junior. That's what it seems like to me. Frying tonight. We're getting bloody undone at the start of this one by Bournemouth. It's 1-0. Oh, no! They made it 2-0! You fucking Oh no, I've accidentally fucking broken the whole fucking plate on the floor, mate! Bollocks, mate! It's gash, guys! What the fuck? They've made it 2-0! How has this happened? And Andre Onana again flapping away at it! Flapping and flapping and flapping away at it! Yeah, yeah I'm sorry, I didn't mean to do that, alright? Stop it! I oh, know that's a really good play! I'm sorry! I apologise, I knocked it with my knee, I didn't even mean to do it, alright? Fucking unbelievable! I'm being serious. Can you shut the door, please? I need my own time. Look, United are just kissing. We're losing 2-0 to Bournemouth, Nicola. We're losing 2-0 to Bournemouth, Nicola, okay? That's good for Bournemouth, isn't it? No, it's not good for Bournemouth. It's a fucking shit show, mate. We're fucking mugs. Andre Onada as well, a.k.a. Mr. fucking Flappy Bird. Look at him get stunned. Sh Luke Shaw, you fucking free Bentos pie-loving fucking garden gnome, bro. It's 2-0 to Bournemouth, man. And I've got to do a fucking clean up now after this game. Bro, what are we doing? What have we become? What have we become? No fucking way! No fucking way, bro! Are you fucking serious, mate? You've got to be fucking kidding me, Deezer! What? What the fuck? It's 3 0 to Bournemouth! We've been smashed by a fucking provincial seaside town! What is happening? Shat on by the Brighton Seagulls! Pissed on by the fucking bomb of Jerry's! Oh my god! At least Bob the Regis aren't in the fucking Premier League, mate! Otherwise we'd be losing a Bogner as well! Oh my god! Oh my god! Free fucking nil! Against the Jerry's! Just blow the fucking whistle, please! End this misery! End this fucking misery, please, immediately right now, please! And there's the final whistle. United have been pumped and done by Bournemouth. It's 3-0 to the Cherries at Old Trafford. Eric Ten Hag, wobble that fucking bald head in disgust, you melt. 
What the fuck are you doing? Overseeing a complete melt fest against the Cherries at home. These players, each single, every single one of these fucking players I've had enough of now. If we're being brutally, totally fucking honest now, these guys can't come to Old Trafford like this after the Chelsea game and play like that. If we're being honest, all of these players need to just fuck off out of our football club immediately now. Just piss off every single one of you, you greedy, money-grabbing bastards. Tony Martin on 200 grand a week. What? It's a fucking disgrace. It's a disgrace. Oh, no! Kingsley Coman's put in the back of the net for Bayern Munich. For fuck's sake, we've been done done. There you go, it's 1 0 to Bayern, and we fucking pants down ourselves yet again. Eric Ten Hag looking on like a complete fucking motor from bloody the Crystal Maze. He's going to pull out the harmonica in a minute and start playing a fucking tune. Oh, look at this. There you go, we've been undone. Very poor play by United. Amrabat gives it away initially. Bruno misses his challenge. McTominay misses his challenge. Maguire, sorry, not Maguire. He's off the pitch, but it feels like the ghost of Maguire because Johnny Evans misses his challenge. And it's just fucking shite that it's played straight through, right through there to Kingsley Tone, but he's banged it in the back of the net. Harry Kane providing the assist. Here's what you could have won. We could have gone and got Harry Kane in the end. We decided to go and get Rasmus Hoynand and Onana and Mason Mount. We fucking shat it with our recruitment. What do you expect? Quality players creating quality chances and they fucking done us. And Harry Kane has created the chance and Coman puts it away. We are shite. And it's piss poor defended by United. Three Manchester United players in a row missed in challenges in there, you fucking gastastic melts, lad. You gas lads. Honestly. And we've been second best throughout. You know, Eric Ten Hag, what the fuck are you doing, mate? What is this as a brand of football? This ain't the brand of football I want to see Manchester United play. It's supposed to be bringing this whole Ajax way. Oh, we're going to start playing this Ajax total Dutch football. The only total it is is total fucking shite football. It's not total Dutch football or any quality football. No, we can't defend. We can't create. We've had three pig in chances throughout this game against Bayern München. And now we're getting fucking munched. And it's 1-0. It doesn't even matter anyway because Copenhagen are winning in the other game anyway. But we're going to finish bottom of the UCL group out of fucking Europe. In disgrace. In disgrace. Eric Ten Hag. United are out of the fucking Champions League, bro. And I think sad we won't even be in the Europa League. Copenhagen have won the game. It's full time. Copenhagen have won. United are shite. Eric Ten Hag, you have absolutely overseen a complete series of melt bags this season. This is unacceptable. Oh my god, there's the final whistle! And Manchester United have just lost. It's the final whistle. Manchester United have lost 1 0 to Bayern Munich on the night. Okay, Mrs. P, go, go, go. Mrs. P. Manchester United have just lost to Bayern Munich 1-0 on the night. It means we finished dead bottom of our group stage and we are the worst team in our group. It's a fucking travesty. There you go, Mrs. B. Thank you. It's a fucking travesty. Eric Ten Hag getting on the team, getting on the pitch there. Cuddling the opposition players. He knows he's in the shit now. What does this mean for Eric Ten Hag? His future is in serious doubt right now. He's the one who's supposed to get this team to play a certain way. He's got us playing like a bunch of fucking absolute milkbags. What are you doing, Eric Ten Hag, lad? I'm looking on. You look like Dan Aykroyd in fucking Coneheads, mate. Do you know what I mean? Not only do you have a pointy fucking top of the pop of your fucking head. We have finished the Champions League group stage. Bottom of the fucking group. Bottom of the group. We are bottom.